every year there's a big football game, uh, University of Florida versus Georgia, and they have it at a neutral site in Jacksonville, Florida. And we were walking to the game, and all I hear in the back of me like, Ryan, Ryan, and I turn around, and it was this big, big woman, <laughs> running, and I turn around, and she was like, she was in midair, jumping at me. I turned around, caught her, her momentum brought me down, and I completely destroyed my entire knee, because my knee hit the curb of the concrete. Completely destroyed my entire knee. Um, I got up, um, I was like, I was like still in shock. I was like, next time, just like, she was crying. She's like, I can't believe it's you. Oh my God, this has been my dream to meet you, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, next time, just tap me on my shoulder and I'll take a picture with you. You don't have to tackle me. <laughs> um, so we took the picture and then later on, I destroyed my entire knee. Meniscus, ACL, MCL, just destroyed everything. And this was in the middle of the season. So I immediately thought like, breaststroke is done. So me doing IM is over. Like I thought like I won't be able to do breaststroke ever again. Just because my whole knee was shattered. Um, I didn't get surgery. I didn't want surgery because I was afraid if I got surgery, um, I would have been able to swim. It would just prolong my surgery. So like I just did rehab, um, just listened to the doctor um, besides doing surgery. Um, ate healthy, I recovered really quickly. And I was back in the water within like a month, a month or two. And I was back doing pressure again like three months. Um, and then later on I went to go on and finally breaking the world record in the 